A quick way of zooming in and out is with shift Control e and then you could come to the extent of the, everything that we have. And you see now, because of the map we have, we come pretty far away. Let's hide the map for a while. We go for tags, formerly called layers. So now you can see how easy it is to just turn it on and off. And now if you choose shift Control e again, it's zooming a lot closer. Let's make an opening on one side here. And I go for offset to make lines that have equally spacing from all edges. So I key in 200. And I will erase the lower line. And I will extend the lines with this tool here. Click once and be careful to go straight down and click again. Let's do it one more time. Take the edge of the line and just take it carefully straight down so you don't have an angle or anything. Now we could just push this in and if we push this far enough we will feel that it snaps to the back side. You could see in the corner that we have minus 2000 millimeters. But we would like to have 200 millimeter wall thickness. So I key in 1800. Enter. Good. Now we could put this in its own tag if we group it. So we frame everything and right click and choose make group. And when we have done that, we could put it into a tag. So let's make a new tag, call it walls. Now when we have a new tag, we could put this group that we just did into that new tag. So right click on the group, choose entity info. And here we could see that right now it's on the untagged. And now we choose the wall tag instead. And now we could turn on and off the tag there. And sometimes I say layer, but I mean tags. Same thing.